Hey everybody, so good news. I recently visited my local dietitian and they gave me suggestions on what my new diet plan should be, which I put it up here on the screen. Kale chips and broccoli, that's all I'm eating for uh, the rest of eternity. But we have a big problem, you see. I got a backpack and it's full of a bunch of junk. So what I wanna do is I wanna remove a food from this backpack, but I only wanna do it if it's not healthy. So what we're gonna be doing is we're gonna be teaching you how to remove elements from a list and also how to check if it's healthy or not. <laughs> so first to remove, all you do is say backpack, and there's a method on here called remove, and this takes the item to remove. So we're going to remove pizza, and then afterwards we are going to print backpack. So running this, and you can see pizza was successfully removed from the backpack. Now I can go in here and I can see that pizza is not in the healthy list. However, what if healthy actually had hundreds of items? I wouldn't wanna use my eyeballs to like look through that, right? I wanna check to see if it's in healthy and if it's not in healthy, then remove it. So here's how you would do that. So we're gonna say, if pizza not in healthy, then if that's the case, we're going to remove it and make sure you indent that. So running this, and we get the same exact result, but it's a little bit smarter because if, if we went in here and put something like kale chips, well, we know that's in healthy, but we can still run this code and check it out. It doesn't remove it from the backpack. So that is how you remove data from a list as well as check to see if it's in a list. The next logical step would be to go through backpack and remove any of that junk we don't want in our life, right? We want to be healthy. We don't need to be eating that junk food. So we're going to go through our backpack and remove anything that's not healthy. And I'm going to show you how to do that with a cool trick in the next video.